Two teams in transition will be the hopes of Terriers and Robins fans today as one place above the relegation trapdoor, Huddersfield, taking a Bristol City side, drifting around mid-table seemingly without a realistic destination. The home side make three changes to the side that drew with Swansea, Wiles, Coroma and Bergzorg, replaced Jackson, Nakayama and Thomas. Both the managers don't have too much experience between them with their respective clubs. 16 games, but plenty with other sides, of course. Should be an interesting meeting of footballing minds. As the rain certainly teams down at the John Smith Stadium. Half-hearted handball looks or claims, certainly. Could be an early opportunity and almost an early own goal as well, frankly. Bristol City try and build again. It's fired through. And the, uh, the deflection almost an own goal. Actually, a... I mean, in all fairness to the goalkeeper, that's a very, very good save. Conditions possibly getting the better of both sides. Matty James in the middle for the Robins, and it's a bit of head tennis at dawn, but an effort through towards Conway. Is Conway going to get there for Bristol City? A good shot, good save. Maxwell's done well, stood up well, but the danger isn't totally clear. Bristol City try and build again, but... It's defended well. It was Conway who was slotted in and he was away. Conway, wasn't he? Helic did well to try and keep up, but Maxwell stood up very, very well. Because of the cap for the through ball earlier by Vyman as well, by the way. Bristol City looking good here. James in towards Vyman again. One must turn provider. Earlier on, his cross there was well kept out by Matthew Pearson. It's December, it's wet. Nice again. James lifted in, half-headed clear, an opportunity to maybe recycle or go again with Conway. Turning neatly in the midfield. Shot comes in and again it's defended well. There's been a couple of occasions of... Relative last gasp defending, but defending well. It was Dickey with it. Defender that just pushed forward. Shot well saved by Maxwell. Bristol City looking sharp. Liam Manning will be pleased thus far. Although here come the home side. Can they get in here? Oh, and what has gone on there? Goalkeeper has had a nightmare. Ward's almost in. He's almost scored with his teeth. His nose, one or the other. That modelling career is possibly over. Oh, the goalkeeper's straight at him. O'Leary got away with that one. Somehow still goalless, this one. Screaming out for a goal. Could it come here? Needs a cross or squared up from distance. James with it! Matty James, Sarasper. Again, it was some more. Terriers late, bodies on the line. We've had the line share so far, Bristol City, although that's not a great corner. Is it going to go back into the danger zone from Tanner? Tanner actually loses out, and this could be an opportunity for breakaway. And look at the bodies that Bristol City have still got forward. It could be an opener, it could be a smash and grab. It is! The opening goal falls to Huddersfield Town. Bergzorg with it, and Bristol City have committed too many bodies forward. Katsumu with the delivery, but Tanner just gets it wrong, and it's easy to blame Tanner, but look, there's no bodies back. Tanner thought about grabbing him back, didn't he? Bringing him down, taking the yellow. That's a beautifully weighted ball, and still a little bit for Bergzorg to do to finish, but he does. His fourth of the season. They haven't lost when he scores, by the way. They were on the front foot, Bristol City and Huddersfield, the home fans, haven't had too much to write home about thus far. 
Bugs all good to go. Darren Moore will have one or two things to say because they might well be one up, but here comes Conway. Conway's got Vyman square. Goes for the shot. It's the side netting that bulges. Andreas Vyman wanted that one square. Conway's looked at it, certainly. Both managers will have a few things to say at half-time. Good half of football. Not the first time the ball's been gifted away on the greasy surface here, but the Terriers with the goal and with the home advantage and with a very happy manager, I'm sure, at the break, although they have gifted Bristol City opportunity. And this could be an equaliser, it is! I've got to say, over the course of the game, it's no less than they deserve. Conway with it immediately after the restart. What a half-time team talk from Liam Manning. A slick move and a perfect pass. Look at that, just slid in beautifully. Byman into Conway, Conway couldn't miss. He's tried to turn provider a few times today, Andreas Vyman finds Conway. And that's Conway's fourth of the season. And I think over the course of the game, Bristol City deserve it. They dominated the chances in the first half. Over the top, and this could be an opportunity to get a second. It's a corner. Pearson clearing it. Badge of honour getting wet on a day like this. If the fans get wet, the manager gets wet. It's neat from the visitors. What can they create from it? The shot whistles in, that's not far. You can see the net just moving from the ball as it whips over the top. Sykes with it, that's not far, just clip the stanchion. Since Nigel Pearson departed, Bristol City just trying to find their way up the table somewhat, but they could be on the back foot here, there's confusion in the box, big shouts for handball! Referee waving them away, not interested at all. The accusation is that it's hit the arm of Tanner, who you'll recall in the first, uh, in the Huddersfield goal, was responsible. He can feel another goal somewhere, can't he? Again, possession gifted. It's happened a lot in this game. And what can the Robins do with it? Low and wide. It was good enough, wasn't it, from Jason Knight, but he dragged it somewhat. Goalkeeper Maxwell will tell you again that he uh, had his angles right here, but wasn't it a million miles away. Jason Knight. Huddersfield looking to restore their lead if they can. Scissors attempt and deflection. Saved well by the goalkeeper. Viner with the deflection. One of the changes for the game with the effort. Again, the keepers have had to react well today. Lots of defending late deflections that have come in. Still remaining one apiece, though. That one, Viner with it. Referee looked like he wanted to blow his whistle, but play on at one apiece. And at one apiece, it will finish. And I think over the course of the game, probably a fair result. Two slick moves, meaning a share of the spoils. It was Conway's goal for Bristol City that equalised after Huddersfield had taken the lead. I think the managers will be relatively pleased with that one. Both teams with opportunities, good goalkeeping, difficult playing conditions as well, you've got to say. A few bones to pick out for the fans, but ultimately, players and management, I think, will take the point.